Hello everybody, this is Jeff at eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a look at this Kodiak E-coated disc brake kit with the 13-inch hub and rotors that have an 8 on 6.5 inch bolt pattern. And this is for the 7,200 pound Dexter axles. Now these brake assemblies will make it easy to change from a drum system to a disc brake system for a lot better performance. The disc brakes deliver better performance than drum brakes because they'll give you more consistent stopping even at highway speeds and even dramatically shorter stopping distances. And even the maintenance costs are a lot lower lower than on drum brakes because you have fewer moving parts to maintain, repair or replace in a disc brake system. Now this kit will include everything I got laid out here on the table. It will include two full brake assemblies. It comes with the two E-coated cast iron rotor and hub assemblies right here. It comes with the two E-coated cast iron calipers as you can see with the brake pads installed. Comes with the four stainless steel mounting bolts for the calipers. Over here we got the two Dacromat coated caliper mounting brackets. And right here you can see it does come with the two see-through oil bath caps that screw onto the outer portion of the hub and drum. <clears throat> now the hydraulic brake actuator and brake lines that are required for brakes to be activated, we do sell those separately on our website. It will require a PSI rating of at least 1500 PSI for disc brakes. Now the E-coat finish that's on the rotors and the calipers, they will provide a nice corrosion resistance for fresh water and salt water use. The hub and drum, it's an integral hub and drum assembly. You can see it's all one piece. The diameter of it is 13 inches. Let me just zoom in so you can get a better look at it. These do minimize lateral runout, prevent any warping. They provide a nice smooth ride with a balanced hub and rotor. And the other nice features, they are a vented design you can see here. This prevents any heat related damage by dissipating the heat. Now these hub and rotors are an oil bath design that will let you check the lubricant level without removing the hub. You can see the caps after you install it will install right just like that. And you'll be able to see through the cap at the oil level, make sure you got enough oil in there. Now these also use industry standard bearings and seals, which we do sell separately on our website. And the part numbers of those bearings and seals are listed on this product page. Now the bearing races are actually pre-installed, so those come included. The calipers right down here, these are a cast iron caliper. They are self-adjusting for smooth equal braking. The cast iron construction does not flex like some of the aluminum design ones. And they are a low drag design. They do retract the piston further than any other calipers for a cooler running brake. And I wanted to pop out, as you can see here, the brake pad. If I pop that one out, if you'd be able to see right there, there's the piston. They use a nickel chrome plated piston, which is two and a half inches in diameter, which is about 30% larger than some of the other brands. So because of it being larger, it gives you more braking torque than the competition. And as we mentioned, the brake pads, which are included, you can see. These are all a high performance ceramic brake pad. The mounting brackets we had mentioned, they are a Dacromat plated mounting bracket, provide strength and durability. They are a side support angle design, ensures that the load is placed on the bracket, not just the bolts. And they do offer extra embossing for additional thread contact to ensure a nice tight secure mounting for those caliper guide bolts when you install it. And if you notice, it is a four bolt brake flange mounting configuration. <clears throat> now this is designed to fit the 7200 pound Dexter axles with the number 42 spindle. The wheel size that will fit on these is 16 inch and larger. We mentioned the bolt pattern on this is 8 on 6 and a half and the wheel lug size that fits on these bolts is 5 8 inch by 18 size lug nuts. And again the lug nuts would be sold separately. But that should do it for the review on this Kodiak E-coated disc brake kit with the 13 inch hub rotors with the eight on six and a half inch bolt pattern for the 7,200 pound Dexter axles.